Hi you guys, it's me, Be Unique. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. If you guys are returning, you know you guys are awesome. So, I gotta tell you, I am super excited. Still, I, ha I still can't get over the fact that we are over 100. And like, oh my God, I love you guys so much and I appreciate each and every one of you. I am truly grateful from the bottom of my heart. Like you have so no- I'm wanting to like try to get this out as soon as possible. And I almost forgot that I even had it in, um, in the mailbox. So I had my mask and I was gonna film a completely different video. But I was like, no, I have to do this one first. So I finally got this month's BoxyCharm in the mail. And let me tell you, I'm super excited. I um, did the add-ons as well. Um, I had gotten an, another palette and another moisturizer. I had to take it like, you know, when there's a deal, there's a deal. And there was money in the bank for that deal. So I was like, I'm, do I'm doing it. I'm doing it. <laughs> so I'm a bit bummed that it didn't come with this month's box being that I technically purchased it before they shipped. So maybe that's something BoxyCharm can work on because I hate having to like look at all my emails and like, no, that one's for this month or that's for this or that's for this and uh, it's just too much, too much. But still, you know, I, I am not hating BoxyCharm, let me tell you, because after this whole ordeal with Ipsy, uh, yeah, uh, I'll give you guys an update on that on the at the end of the video. So anyway, this month we have a little, it's not like it's the card stock, we got like a little paper folded paper whatever um i got variation eight i think i think that's what is it whatever um so obviously they're telling us all about the premium that's coming up i did sign up for the notification email so i'm hoping that i will be able to jump on that bandwagon because i am I was needing another something i need something because as far as i know you open it up they give you all the prices and all the right so this theme is after dark and the first one that they have listed is of course one of the dose of colors eyeshadow palettes um i got the blushing berries this retails for 32 dollars i was gobsmacked when i found out that it was worth that much i thought it was actually worth a little bit less it's a beautiful palette i mean i i i love this packaging it's simple but like, I don't know, it's just it's calls to me. Oh yeah, and then I was about to open it. It has all the shades in the back, all the ingredients, cruelty free, paraben free, talc free. Um, okay, so as far as I know, they're all mattes, which is fine because I am a hooded lid type of person. And let me tell you, so if, like if I get a palette with a lot of shimmers I, it's useless to me because like I also have a little slight texture on my skin as well so I'm just ew, try to open this without Ugh. it comes with a, ah, comes with a little brush I love all the shades I, this was the palette that I was actually saying to myself man I really hope I get this one but if I get this other one or this one I'll be just as happy you know but this is my first pick so I'm super excited about that um I love how it's I just, I don't know, I like the packaging. It feels very nice. Um, I love that it's thin, it's sleek. I love it. So I can't wait to play with those. Um, I don't want to swatch it, just, I don't know, like, because even though I wanted this one, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I don't know if I'm going to put it in my giveaway drawer or what. I don't know yet, so. Because I also have similar colors, so I don't know. But I also don't don't have this brand this is the first item of this brand that i have in my collection so i don't know we'll see um so that one retails for 32 the next is the touch and soul pretty filter glass skin balm this is my choice item because i needed a moisturizer and i was like thank you lord jesus so i love the pink i love pink so pink mask oh by the way it's mask monday i totally forgot mask monday but yeah, I love this. I, I know. I love it. I love that package. I thought the moisture was going to be a little bit bigger. Like, if you open up the lid, it looks massive. Wow. Okay. And it does come sealed, which is cool. All the... Oh, well. Sealed to an extent. I mean, I guess that's a lot. That one retails for a 32 as well. Wow. Okay. So, that one's hydrating... I get a priming skin balm. Okay. Um, 
so you know the koreans they are into that glass skin and me too because if i could achieve that even though my pores are massive but a girl could dream <laughs> the other item i got was the iconic london lip plumping gloss this is also the first item or of the brand because I, I never had oh yeah i don't have this brand um i love the color i'm i wish it was more of a nude but maybe i'm gonna keep this so i'm gonna open it <laughs> um oh okay the doe foot on this is slightly curved can you guys see that it's slightly curved i've never um i feel like putting it on hmm. okay oh okay it has a scent but i don't know what that smells like i'm gonna try okay i left it dry anyway Oh, okay, so this is like very sheer. Let's see if I feel any tingles. I don't know if I like the doe foot, actually. Oh, I'm starting to feel the tingles. But the lip gloss itself feels really nice. It doesn't feel sticky. But I do feel something. And I like that... Even though in the bottle it looks very pink, it's actually not. That one retails for $26. Uh, let's see what it says. Ultimate combo of non-sticky, which is, yep, yeah, I will give it that. And pumping power. Eye shine formula is infused with a bio -met Make sure I'm reading this right. Biomimetic peptide? Oh. Which helps support natural collagen production for more defined and vol voluminous looking lips. Blech. Man, I can't read. <laughs> so that's very interesting. Okay. I do have a lip plumper and I wonder if I should try that on camera one day for you guys. I think it's so funny when I use it. Um, then last, no, not last, second to last item is worth $17. Um, and this is from Kogendo. Kogendo Cleansing Spot Water Cloths. This convenient cotton cleansing spa water removes waterproof makeup and impurities while nourishing the skin with mineral rich cleansing spa water. Ooh. Um, I don't think I'll probably ever use these. I'll probably put this in my giveaway drawer. These little wipes. Um, just because, like, I have tons like that I purchased. Like, I buy them in, like, the giant tube. I'll show you guys. Like, I, when I get, I get this every time I need wipes. And yeah <laughs> so i'm probably oh i'm sorry i'm moving my camera i'm probably just gonna put that in my giveaway drawer all right so the last one is luna by luna eyeliner this one retails for 16 dollars these highly pigmented and easy glide pencil eyeliners are perfect to create a full lash line or a playful colored look that lasts all day Ooh, 24 hour wear you guys okay i mean I will never use, I'm not a pencil eyeliner. <clears throat> I'm not a pencil eyeliner type of girl. I like the liquid or like a gel. Um, and it's not that they're bad, like, or one is better than the other. It's just my eye type. And then my eyelids are super small. Like, look at all that. Like, if I go like this, let's see. What can I use to actually show you guys what I am talking about? Here, I'm gonna use my little pimple. This clean. No, maybe not. <laughs> I'm gonna use this. Uh, here, okay, I'm gonna use this. So, like, if I go like that, that is where my crease should be. Okay, this. Look at all that space that I should have. That I it just disappears. Even like, yeah, look at that. Okay. I, so, ah. Boxy Charm update. I got an email from them the other day because my Lux was not the choice items. They did say it's on its way, although the curling iron that was originally in or supposed to be in the Lux, I guess they ran out and it's still going to be the same brand. They're going to send me a different barrel size or something. I don't, I don't really know. Um, so yeah, I thought that was very interesting. At least they're like updating me on like what's going on because it is October. They said I was supposed to get it by October. So, you know, at least I gotta say way better, you know, their communication is way better than Ipsy. So with that being said, we're going to move on to the Ipsy update. I don't know if you guys have seen my giveaway video. If you have not, click that video, 
watch that video, subscribe, and comment in that video to enter my giveaway, by the way. If it's not already closed, I don't think it will be. Like, but yeah. So, after I had posted that video, or maybe not after, like, it was just, um, I had gotten an email as an update and they offered me the five items. And I was just like, no, I don't want your items. I'm like, I'm done. <laughs> it's everything. I'm just so frustrated. So then they emailed me back and they were like, well, you know, we're going to give you next month free. So I was very surprised that they even offered that because I am so frustrated with the way that whole process went. I'm, I know I'm not the only one. I'm pretty sure you guys understand, but I'm not going to go ramble too much on. I did appreciate the fact that they are willing to give me a free box, even though I had already canceled. So I went to see like my account and it does say, um, that my subscription is ended, but it doesn't end until the end of November. So if you guys don't know, or, you know, just check your account if you have been emailing them and yeah, just, I went through a long email process. So, I mean, at least they're trying. I'm hoping, I am hoping for their sakes, not my sake, not anybody else's sake. I'm hoping for Ipsy's sake that they do get on their game and because, yeah, mm. whether or not I will re uh, subscribe to them, I don't, I honestly don't think I will. I mean, you had the one chance to get it right or don't do it at all. I mean, I don't know. Maybe if you guys tell me, leave a comment down below and tell me guys what you think about this whole situation because I don't know. The sneak peek that I've seen already was another collab from Ipsy and somebody else. And I don't even know who that girl was. I mean, you know, no offense or anything, but like, I don't know who she is and they were clapping. I know that's going to be in the box. So in my opinion, that should be a bonus item that should not count in the value of the box. That should be something completely separate that if they want to advertise their own brand, because now they want to reach out and, and venture out into makeup, that should be a bonus item for people to try. And then after a year of testing, get people's feedback and then decide whether or not you want to sell it or put it in the value of the box, get of your customers, a consumer's opinion. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe that's a stupid idea, but to me, that's what I, I would suggest, but yeah. So yeah, I'm going to cut this video, uh, short. We're going to stop talking because I could ramble on and on and on and on, apparently. <laughs> so, um, just as a reminder, you guys, if you have not entered my giveaway, go find that video it is the, uh, Ipsy rant 100 subscriber video giveaway. Leave a comment down below. Make sure you are subscribed and please make sure your subscriber list is public. That way, once I pick a winner, I can verify that you are subscribed because if you're not subscribed, you are not qualified in the giveaway. So make sure you like, comment, give me a thumbs up, you know, the deal. Come join my beehive if you have not already. Tell others to join the beehive <laughs> and help pollinate. Let's come on, busy bees. Let's get going out there and spread. Oh.